Hey there, welcome once again to Speed Skating Deconstructed. What makes a skater great? Back to U.S. selection for the World Cups in October. Connor McDermott with Stowey on the outer here. Cooper McLeod on the inner. Going to focus on Cooper, but these are both a couple of young Americans coming up. Um, and they've trained together for so long, and they have a really good cohort in the U.S. right now of, of really uh, generating some great skating. And they do it in these these great, like, three, four, five guys training together groups. So it's great to see. Cooper uh, is in the middle of the beat group um, so far in World Cups, trying to move up. He's only 21, and he's a very skilled technician. So we're going to focus on him, and the quality isn't great here, but uh, we're not about perfection, we're about helping people, so let's look at it. Right off the start, very good power. Driving that knees right on top seat, right on top of that skate, even before he gets into a skating stride wide here though you can see in the middle but again it takes a while to straighten that stuff out you can see his recovery right here not optimal clear that up you want to drive that knee sooner in the recovery you don't want that knee to go out and then in so the Cooper what I would say is off this left you really got to really use your core to drive that under you you want to undo better so it was a solid opener, fast, 9-7. See how he enters this turn. Yeah, no transition, best transition. Let's see, is there any pause? No. That's what I mean by no transition. Good, very good lay in, in the turn. Excellent timing, right on that right, right away. So that's nice, turn it to a good. Let's see how his exit looks. Again, apologize for the quality here, but we can see what we need to see. Nice line. And he doesn't get a lot of outer. So that means he can turn that skate over fast and get pressure right into the ice. So that's very good. He's moving with that lead nicely. Right there. Very good power. And you notice he's got a lot of hip flexibility. The skate moves out, but he's not on the skate. He's using the clap and he's out here. So it's really excellent timing. Very good technician. And notice the, the drive across. You can just see it coming across this blade so fast. Watch this. Right there. Really, really good. Let's watch it in slow motion. See how much pressure right away he gets? You can see it. It's from the glue. You can tell his push is from the glue. You can just see it. It's palpable. And that's where you want to be. You're not pushing with your quads. You're pushing with the quads you late. So let's look at this again. Watch how quickly he transfers his weight and it's right out. There's no delay. No delay. That's why he's going to be great. 21 years old, skating so well. Look at this sitting position. Really good power. Watch his setup. It's perfect. Uh, maybe a little tight. You want to come around just a little, but you have to set that up early and straight away. So again, he's young. This might be just a little tight, but again, nice lay-in. Really good reversal of the arm. We've talked about that early reversal. means you're going to be early on your skates. So great skating by Cooper McLeod. Back in the U.S. trials, hoping these guys, Connor and Cooper and Austin and uh, so many others, uh, continue to improve for the U.S. So we'll talk to you next time on Speed Skating Deconstructed, What Makes a Skater Great. Bye-bye.